AI music is here. Listen to this. And Suno AI is one of the best. So let's dive onto the computer and have a look at how you can make your own AI generated music. Here in my browser, I'm going to navigate to suno.com. And the first thing you'll want to do is have a look at the website and explore some of the music that is available on their website. So for example, here you can see some of the trending songs. I'm going to scroll down. One example is the cat song. Let's have a look at it. Okay, great first example, but can it do different styles? Well, let's scroll down a little bit further and let's find out if it can do other styles as well. Here we've got some uplifting epic pop. Okay, maybe we are looking for something a little bit more deeper. Let's have some lo-fi Japanese funk. So as you can see, it's an incredibly versatile platform. One of my favorites so far of what I've seen on the trending page is this one, which is the 50 decimal places of Pi. So as you can see, it all comes with the lyrics so and those we were also generated. So just an example of what's available and what can be generated with Suno. Now you will agree, this is already incredible. So let's go ahead and make our own Suno AI generated music. We're going to go to create and sign up with our account. So I'm going to use my Google account to log into this one. Just going to click on Google, I'm going to agree to all the terms of service, and then I'm going to generate some music. So here you can see we have two modes. We have the simple interface. That is what you see here, where we can describe our song, ask for an instrumental or not. And of course, we're using version three, the latest version of Suno. That's what you've been hearing. That's where that really good quality comes from. Or we can go into custom mode. And in custom mode, we can paste our own lyrics. We can also, again, select that we would like an instrumental and we can choose the style of music. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the simple mode and I'm going to describe the song. I want a lo-fi house song about the animal classifications. Include mammals, fish, birds, reptiles, amphibians, and some of their characteristics. And there we go. Now I'm just going to fix some of these typos in my text. I know I'm terrible at spelling. So here we can go. It's not boards, it's birds. Let's fix that. Now we do not need an instrumental for this because we do want AI to generate those lyrics as well. And we're going to use version three. So let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to click on create. And Suno will start generating both the lyrics of the song as well as the music. Now I did ask for a house song. So it's going to probably be some lo-fi house music. But you could choose any genre you want. So we'll do a different genre later. So let's see what Suno is generating. Okay, so here you can see we have two songs generated. It says house electronic. Let's listen to what Suno has generated for us. We're going to press play.
Great first song. Let's listen to the second generated song. Mammals on the dance floor. Moving with style from the big old fence to the fairy with smile. They got fur. They got milk. They want body too. Mammals in the house, girl. Moving all night through. Fish in the river. Swimming with grace. From the colorful bed of fish to the shots in the chase. Okay, so let's say that we now want to use this in one of our creative projects or in class. Well, what we can do now is here on these three dots, we can either reuse this prompt, rename the song or download it. Now here you can download the audio track or a video track. I'm going to download the audio, click on download and that audio file will automatically be downloaded. There it is. And I can now use it in any creative project I would like. In addition to that, we can also make this track public or we can share it. We can copy that link. And then when other people click on the link, they enter the Suno interface and they can listen to this song. Now let's play around with some different genres. So here I'm going to just change this. I'm going to say a blues song about the noise a frog makes at night. There we go. And we're going to click on create. So this is a very general description. I want it to be about frogs, the noise they make, and I want it to be blues. Now, I did not specify what type of blues music I'm looking for. So let's see what Suno comes up with. Okay, we have the Midnight Croak and another Midnight Croak. We have a slow tempo, soulful blues. So let's have a listen. I'm going to click on this. Well, it's midnight in the swamp. Air is thick and black I'm sitting on my porch Just trying to relax There's a sound that's haunting me Driving me insane It's the croaking of that frog Playing his sorrowful refrain I gotta tell you Folks, it's a lonesome kind of tune. Hear it every night underneath the silvery moon. Okay, excellent. Let's listen to the second song. There's midnight in the swamp. The air is thick and black. I'm sitting on my porch. Just trying to relax But there's a sound that's haunting me Driving me insane It's the croaking of that frog Playing his song afraid I gotta tell you Folks It's a lonesome kind of tune Brilliant. Now let's say that I want to turn this into a full song. Well, you can do that as well. Now you will need credits for this. And we're going to click on the song. This opens up the song page. You can see the song page has the lyrics. It has everything, but it stops here at the end. Now, if I wanted to extend this song, I could do that. I can click on the three dots here. And what I can do is I can here click on extend which will then extend this song. And that's Suno AI, an amazing generative AI platform to create music that you can then use in all your projects. I hope you found this helpful. If you did, make sure to subscribe to the channel. I also want to say a quick thank you to all the channel members. Thank you for making the creation of this content possible. You are helping us create new content each and every week. Now, if you would like to become a channel member as well, you can scroll down and find that join button at the bottom. In the meantime, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.